Ontario's harmonized sales tax is turning one years old, but no surprise, the opposition parties at Queen's Park aren't exactly celebrating. This is uh, one anniversary that really doesn't deserve a party. The NDP's election document, Put People First, is promising a number of breaks on the controversial tax. Uh, and that's why we're making those commitments around the HST off of home heating, the permanent uh, reduction of the HST off of hydro bills, and starting to get some relief off of gas prices. PC leader Tim Hudak's election platform, Changebook, is also committed to HST and tax relief. As Premier, I will eliminate Dalton McGuinty's sneaky eco-taxes once and for all. But the Ontario Liberals are telling the opposition parties to put their policy where their mouths are. If they really don't like the HST, why aren't they prepared to scrap it? Ontario NDP leader Andrea Horvath says financial penalties built into the HST make that an impossible option. We know that the uh, government of Ontario struck this uh, $4.3 billion deal with the feds. Uh, we know that uh, it's going to be really tough to get out of that in the short term. While all three political parties have a different vision for the HST, they're all prepared to leave it in place, meaning many more anniversaries for the HST. For the Toronto Sun, I'm Antonella Artuso.